Okay, I think this is the one, or no, second to the last dungeon before I go to Spellhold. This is Diarni's Keep. And uh, this is actually one you can do really early, but of course I I waited pretty pretty late in the game. But it does have an item that's really, really useful. Uh, oh yeah, and I was going to figure out how to do my Stronghold. Oh well, I forgot to look that up. We'll get to that later. There you are. I've been waiting positively ages for you. <clears throat> okay, I think you can get uh, I think you can get fire arrows from this guy. Yeah, I'm not gonna bother though. Yeah, you give us an item and that's fire arrows. Okay, big deal. But we don't need it. We don't need it. All right, here we go. This is actually a pretty easy one. We'll blow through this like no time. Okay, little uh, little something there. Potion of stone skin. I know what that is without having to identify it. Got a crappy crossbow and uh, also a, another bolt, bolt of lightning. There are quite a few bolts of lightning in this game, I guess. <clears throat> I tore myself, strike you down by Uncle See if I can get him before he gets. Yeah, I did. Well, I helped you, dude. Come on now. Um, yeah, so her, uh, yeah. Her keep was taken over by, uh, trolls, as will happen, I guess. Eh, I don't need any of that. Eh, there's stuff I could sell if I really wanted to, but I don't. I'm not gonna bother. There is, however, something over here that I need to get. I approve heartily of the path <clears throat> you've taken so far. The good has been upheld. You sound like Goladon. Let's see here. Uh, this, okay. Oh, I could do that. Thought those were trapped, but apparently, oh, this is trapped. I think. Yeah, there's a flail head here. You can get the flail of ages in in here, and flail of ages is actually really nice. Okay, well, it wasn't trapped. I thought it was. Find familiar, but we don't need it. Okay, the flail head. You have to get the three flail heads and combine them. Ring of Earth Control is a pretty nice little little thing that gives you plus one armor class. <clears throat> you can charm Earth Elemental, but it's a very unlikely to work. But the plus one armor class is always nice. Let's see here, who needs a ring? Give one to Minsk. There we go. Oh, actually, no. You know who needs that ring? Keldor, get well, Keldorn. I want to get Keldorn's armor class low, so yeah, I am going to give him that. We'll give Mince the Ring of Fire Resistance, and then <clears throat> we'll also give uh, Keldorn the Ring of Gax to lower his AC even lower, because his his AC is really kind of not low enough we, we really need to drop his ac as much as we can we'll probably give him no we can't do that but uh yeah maybe we can give him that cloak because he's the front line guy and so well that kind of drops his charisma huh he's kind of our now yeah, let's let's keep that on until we really need it anyway uh we want we want Keldorn to have really low AC because he's using a two-handed sword. He can't use a shield. He can actually get his AC pretty low if you count uh, protection from evil, which, you know, most things you're going to fight are going to be evil. And so, you know, that's a plus two right there. Then you got uh, plus one cloak. You know, plus two ring of gax. I hate these things, but these things are no longer a problem. 
Oh yeah, that's right. He can't be hit by missile damage. God, I hate those. Um, yeah, there's a whole thing you could do. I think we gotta open the gates here, right? Yeah. <clears throat> I think we gotta open the gates. With vengeance. Didn't fall down yet, huh? Okay. Dude! There we go. Okay, so there you you open the gate for I guess the uh, the troops to come back in and help you take the place. All right, and that's that's it for that. Was there anything over there? No. You can do a whole quest where you get some dog meat and stuff like that. Put in a pot. It's it's totally unnecessary though, as far as I'm concerned. I don't bother with it. Um, yeah, there's something over here, and then yeah, this is where you get the pot. Okay, yeah, this is where you can cook the meat in here. I believe there's something over here. I believe trolls are evil, so protection from evil adds it to armor class. Although I don't know if I got it off. I might have gotten uh, interrupted. Dude, come on. Kill that thing. You don't need to go all the way over there. Oh, idiots. Is there anything I can kill this guy with without having to actually put my archer over there? Uh... Yeah, you can also summon this guy who's got some fire spells, or he's got Melf's acid arrow, which will work. Oh, well, it won't if he wakes up all of a sudden. What is there a gripping about? What the? Oh, thanks a lot, dude. Got another fire spell real quick. <laughs> this is a mess. This is why I hate fighting trolls. This is such a mess. I can't even see where my guy is. Oh, did you hear already? Oh my god, really? What the hell? I can't even see where... Where is... Oh, he's way over here. What the freaking hell? God, what a disaster. Yeah, fighting trolls is a pain in the ass. This is why I think I am going to use Chrome Fear. Because this is such a pain in the butt. I am your I have very many fallen comrades. Let us endeavor to remain hail. Alright, i got to pick up the freaking... Freaking Just Rod of Resurrection here. A little rest will save us from our eyes. Have, have we not time to sleep? The sleep and the spirit is willing, my friend. We must rest soon. Demands rest. Who is getting squirrely? Jeez. All right. So, Jupira picks up her crap, and okay, I can't use that. What a pain in the butt! What a pain in the butt! Can we rest here? Oh, not really. Duty eye, as you wish. Yes. All right, let's rest outside then. You must gather your party before venturing forth. 
There we go. Okay, you can always rest outside. Alright, well, forget about those guys. Let's go over here. The, the really annoying thing about it is, is like, it takes them a while to fall down, so you have to wait for them to fall down, and then you have to, you know, get find something with acid or fire on it to kill them. It's so annoying. They are such an annoying foe. That's why I can't wait till I can use the death spell, because I'll just load those up and, and we'll death spell them. Are you sure that this isn't trapped? I thought this was trapped. Pretty sure it was trapped. I think that's a new spell. That's it? There's this over here, I guess. Okay. Well, we gotta go right here real quick. Maybe not. Okay, this is, does not open this up for some reason. How did I open that up? I must be... Oh... No, 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 no. No, I go over here, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we gotta go over here and fight somebody, that's right. See you later. There we go. This sparrow is ready to fly. Haste lasts for so such short a time nowadays, it seems. There we go. That's why it's nice to have that fire crossbow. Oh, wait a minute. I'm sure, I'm sure, almost sure this is trapped. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, there's the key that I was wanting. Now I can go over here, I believe. Let me just send Keldorn over here real quick to see if I can do it with Keldorn. Uh, there's actually this over here. Oh, well, that's trapped. Okay. Oh, I remember this. No, we, we're going to need the whole party. <clears throat> yeah, we got to go over here first is the problem. I got another um, bolt of lightning, looks like. And then a little gem here that I don't really care too much about, but I'll take anyway. Wand of Frost. Well, it probably sells for something, so it's not so bad. I am yours to direct, my I'm friend. pretty sure this has a trap on it. I'd be shocked if it doesn't. Yeah, there we go. We shall strike a blow what deep into evil's heart. What can it be now? Oh, uh, yeah, we probably don't want to. Oh, we did kill him. Whoopsie. All right, well, he's got some nice armor on him. He's got a pretty nice potion, too. Awesome. All right. So, do we want to go in here? Yeah, I don't think we really need to go in here. There's nothing in here, actually. So, no, nah, we don't need to go in here. Whoops. Things in my way, man. I can't go through here. So, we got another flail head, right? Right. Uh, we probably want to go around this way. Okay, here's where we want to go. We want to go in here. This is Nalia's mom, I guess. Yet more hooligans tracking their filth through the halls. 
I remember the first time I met this lady, I so wanted to kill her. Alright, I think the encounter rate should be a little lower here, so... Or actually, the encounter rate is zero in this room, I think. So, let's go ahead and... The heck? Who's lagging? Who is freaking lagging? I guess it's me. There we go. Um, these golems won't attack until you attack them. We want to get rid of the stone golem, probably. Or not the stone golem, the clay golem. What is this one? There's the clay golem. Everybody else can be killed by normal weapons. Okay. So we're just going to trap. I can hear you just fine. I've set a trap for the feet of the unwary. Set a few traps for this guy, and the rest we'll just take out with our weapons. I've set a trap. Ah, this reminds me I, am I ready? of the sellers. Except Uncle Gerhard is still in the corner. This isn't boring. I'll give it that. <laughs> Um, there we go. Okay, he basically died of the poison. Flesh Golem. That's easy. Oh, and I guess we're just going to start attacking them, huh? Okay. Yeah, like I said, Stone Golem's very easy. It's the Clay Golem that's a pain in the ass because I had to f I'd have to switch weapons. Not that he's really a pain in the butt, but... Okay, now we just go after this guy. No damage. No doubt. You will fall yet. No doubt. Interesting. No doubt. Yeah, we just beat him to beat him up. He takes less damage, but he's not immune. All right, so we get a uh, bow, a nice axe, and uh, I guess a nice. Um, it's it's actually an okay weapon, theoretically, because it's uh, it, it can hit um at a pretty high. Like, uh, hits as a plus. I, I think this hits as a plus four. Even though it says it's plus one, I think this hits as a plus four. So, technically, if you needed a plus four weapon, Elven Court Bow, um, sounds nice, but, uh, doesn't really, doesn't really do anything special. And the Frost Reaver plus three, that's, uh, that's an okay axe. Yeah, you get some okay weapons here. They're not, I mean, right now for me, they're not great because I'm, I'm kind of pretty far ahead and, uh, you know, pretty advanced already, so I don't really need them, but, uh, you know, technically they're pretty good. Oh, wait, who's encumbered? Oh, what the freaking Jan is encumbered. Okay, Jan, you piece of crap. You wimpy piece of crap, you. Who did I get the Gauntlets of Strength to? Yeah, Gauntlets of Overpower. Okay, here Dallas has it. Wasn't sure about that. <clears throat> I remember picking it up. All right, we're going to go make the uh, Flail of Ages, basically, heroes, really quickly. The Flail of Ages is actually a really awesome weapon. Uh, if you're going to, like, dual weld and, you know, have, uh, have another nice weapon in the offhand that maybe gives plus one attacks, it is a really, really awesome weapon. Um, okay, so let's just taste, let's just taste again. Let's just send Keldorn to go do this. Because he's got the boots of speed on. Ah, oh boy, somebody's, what? Somebody's following me. I don't care. There it is. Made the Flail of Ages. Good, that's all we needed to do here. Now we just go back up the stairs. Continue to kick butt. Got it. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go do this this thing here. Oh, no, you guys don't. No, you guys don't. I don't think so. I'm just going to run away. Am I missing? I am missing somebody. Where's the other guy? Come on. Come on. Who's lagging? Yeah, Jan. Of course you're lagging, you bastard. All right, where's the Flail of Ages? Here it is right here. You know what's so powerful about this is the 33% chance of slowing a target for 20 seconds. No save. 
and god that is so overpowered in fact almost now that i think about it i almost wish that um i had actually uh i had actually a another melee character besides Keldorn, because that is so freaking overpowered, especially if you dual weld this with a sword that gives you plus one attacks, and then, like, uh, improved haste, so you get, like, ten attacks per round. It's just devastating. Plus, it's a crushing weapon, so you can kill, like, golems with it and stuff like that. But um, we actually have uh, flail proficiency on my main character, by the way. So, um... Yeah, so anytime we run into a golem or something and we need uh, we need to take it out, Flail of Ages, baby. Really easy. And Daystar, I'm going to take Daystar off. We don't really need that. Daystar plus, plus two, yeah. Let's put that on Keldorn. That'll give him the ability to use that destroy undead thing. Tom's name. <clears throat> and then... Is this, is this trapped... Oh, yeah, it was. Okay, well, anyway, the only reason I did that was for this shield amulet. Um, it's got a bunch of charges, and you can use that to give yourself an armor class of four. I guess if you're a Kensai, you could use that. A solo Kensai, you could use that to actually get a decent armor class. Otherwise, um, it's very inferior to the spell spirit armor, so there's no real reason to use it. Finally keel over there. There you go. You have to literally just wait for these bastards to keel over dead before you can do anything. Sometimes they just don't... It's so stupid. And why didn't they fix this with the Enhanced Edition? I don't know. You, here you are waiting for these guys to keel over and they take forever and it sucks. Let me go ahead and... Uh, let's see here. I'm, I assume these are trapped. Makes sense if these were trapped. No, they're not. That's kind of strange. Yeah. <laughs> no, well, there's a there's a weird gem I probably haven't picked up yet, so I'm gonna pick it up. All right, we're going to go ahead and sleep. Oh, great. I'm gonna try to sleep. I might have to go back upstairs to sleep. I shall do my utmost. All right, now we're going to sleep. Let's recast our stuff. <clears throat> I wish I had the death spell to deal with this next room, but I don't. So we're probably just going to send Keldorn in with protection from evil, and he probably won't get confused. Another thing you can do is you can just use, like, a wand of cloud kill here. Or, one of these harps, you can actually use this. These guys probably aren't immune to confusion. I think, uh, I think I got one, in fact. I am yours yeah. So be it. Oh, well, it looks like they are immune to confusion. Okay, go figure that. Uh, death spell will just wipe these guys out instantly. And that would be kind of a nice way to deal with them. And I am getting my ass kicked. You will fall yet. They Umber Hulks are actually really annoying enemies. In, in the beginning, especially. I believe there's. Is there something over here? Okay, I, okay, I already got one of those. That is a piece of crap armor, but I'll take it anyway just to sell it, I think. Yeah, it's a piece of crap at this point in the game. And there's stuff that I don't need. Okay, let's just go go finish it. I smell you. I do. You Braddock. No be hiding on Holy ouch. Okay, these guys actually hurt from what I remember. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and uh, maybe confuse. We might summon up a golem. Summon up a genie. And 
maybe not stand quite so close. Oh, wonderful. Thank you, Mr. Genie, for doing that. That really helps. Okay, we better get out of the line of fire here. I am yours to direct, my friend. Armored, sharpened, where Minsk goes, evil. Jump on my sword while you can, evil. You I I a solid a blow. Oh, come on. Bull crap. Oh, I got him. Okay, never mind. Okay. All right, he killed my genie. That's okay. Let's see. What else can we do here? Summon something, I guess. Well, don't just stand there. Kill him. Finish him off. There we go. Come on. There you are. All right, cool. Got him. No problem. See if we can mass heal a little bit. I'm not sure if this was actually trapped. Okay, he didn't drop anything. I don't remember. Was this trapped? I don't remember. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We'll assume it wasn't trapped. Okay, it wasn't trapped. So, we got some useless crap here, it looks like. Uh, I'm sure I already have copies of these gems. Oh, there's a lot of copies of that gem. What is this? A bloodstone amulet. That's too that's too common to really care about. Okay, and I think we're done. That was it. It's very short actually, once you you know once you're this high level, it's not a big deal at all. It can actually give you some trouble in the beginning because if you don't have any way to kill trolls. Trolls are actually pretty good melee characters, or opponents anyway. So I remember actually when I was when I was a young lad, first playing this game, and I came in here and I was getting my butt kicked. Because I came in here, like, right at the beginning. And uh, I would be getting my butt handed to me. You must gather your party before venturing. It's still a fun game. I remember, you know, this is still, still a fun game. It's fun to go through the storyline. It's very... Um, Entertaining. I have a life to continue, and I do not need to be picking at old wounds. All right. So I. Jeez. Dear Are we gonna get any farther in this thing? I think we're gonna be in the underdark before we finally finish her romance, which is too bad. I don't think the dialogue, the romance dialogue, will continue when I'm in the Underdark. I think, uh, well, I don't know. They might have, they might have made it so it did. It didn't used to. It used to be you had to be outside to to actually have that uh, dialogue um, trigger. They definitely changed that, but I don't know if uh, I don't know if it'll continue. Well, I can't continue in the Underdark because I can't complete the quest in the Underdark. Yeah, so I guess it wouldn't. You, you've done it. They're all dead? What of, what of my father? Is he well? Mm. Okay. Yeah, um, I can't get that stronghold because I'm not a fighter. I think. Jan got a level up, so we got a level up out of it. What should I do here? Detect illusion, find traps. Let's let's pump up find traps to a hundred. That way, we don't really need our gear. <clears throat> okay, so that was that. That was the DRNE's quest. And, oh wait, Jan did not get a mage level, so... Well, he's pretty close to mage level. He should get it with the next, um, the next quest. Alright, so, yep, we've done everything except... Need to go back to the temple district. And we need to finish the Beholder quest. In Torm's name, I shall serve. This sparrow is ready to fly. 
just remembered something okay there's a building over here um that you can get into a fight it's a pretty fun fight i think we'll go for it because um well it's pretty profitable and it won't take me too long not at this level Let's see if i can get away with resting haha <laughs> i did it all right um, actually, let's see here. What, uh, do we need anything with Jahira? We probably want the Insect Plague with Jahira. Let's go ahead and give protection from everything to him. Chaotic Commands. We're definitely... You can also get into a fight with a, a demon in here, and we don't... We actually kind of don't want to do that. Um, insect plague, that's fine. Yeah, we should be able to disable everybody before they get to uh, get to do anything. All right. <clears throat> so we're going in, and it's where it's right there. Oh wait. Haste. Oh yes. Challenge me, will you, bro? This is a place where you can get a really nice weapon if you're into katanas. It's one that basically uh, stuns, and if if the target fails to save, and it's extremely extremely powerful. Um, we don't have anybody that can actually use it, so. But uh, you know, if you do have again another melee character, there's a lot of fun stuff you can do with melee characters in this game. But we're we're ranged, if you'll remember, so. Okay, yeah, here's where we get, like, a demon summoned out of nowhere. But he's gonna die. And there's also... These annoying little things here. What the heck happened to me? How did I get poisoned? Holy crap, I got poisoned somehow. Okay, good. Now we just gotta kill this stupid genie. Stupid Ifrit, die. Okay, cool. We wiped everything out, which is pretty good, actually. These, uh, this demon that spawned, those guys are actually pretty hard. <clears throat> Alright, so we're gonna go run right up here. And make sure we're paused. is gonna go ahead and cast, uh, cast Insect Plague on this guy, I guess. Here, Dallas is gonna try to confuse him. I'm gonna summon, summon a golem here. Then we're gonna summon this guy, and I'm gonna turn off party AI so my guys don't go rushing in and die. And then with my guy, I'll go ahead and cast Horror. Okay. And then we got, uh, yeah, all right, we're good. Should be good. Um, we just need Jan to kind of like disarm this trap that's down here because we don't want to get hit by this trap. Ouch! Son of a gun. There it is. Okay, I just about walked into it. Okay, now that I have that trap disarmed, now I'm perfectly fine with actually going over there. Let me see if I can get Jan to uh, cast his own skin. There we go. No way! I don't believe they stunned Keldorn. The the chances of that are so so freaking small. This sparrow is ready to fly. All right, die. I don't believe they stunned Keldorn. How the hell did he do that? All right, I'm gonna go back here with this guy. These guys are actually pretty nasty melee characters from what I remember. Oh no, oh the mage woke up. Oh well let's uh, summon summon this guy over here. Okay, so I'm kind of in trouble here. Every hamster has his day. Uh, I gotta do something about these guys. I don't believe that I'm in... I'm having such a problem with this. 
Holy ouch. Okay, well, my main hero is almost gone. I'm going to have to reload. So that, that didn't go too well. I'm kind of so shocked that, that that went so poorly, in fact. Okay, let's... um. You know what? Let's just target this guy first. I'm going to turn off the AI. Again, we're just going to throw everything we can at this guy right now. This sparrow is ready to fly. Let's go ahead and try and confuse Gollum. Okay, now he's dead. Okay, the mage is gone, so we don't have to worry about that crap now. How did he get? Oh, okay. Okay, he got stunned by the weapon, the katana. I don't believe it. I don't believe it, man. He's got such low saves too. What's her saves? Let's see his saves. Yeah, come on, cut me some slack for crying out loud. All right, well, I'm going to lose Keldorn. Um, he's gotten basically surrounded by these guys. Uh, let's see, unless I can, like, do something here. Maybe I can. Maybe they'll... Oh, good, okay. Problem is I can't go anywhere without disarming these traps, otherwise it's, it's just a huge problem. Okay, so now maybe I could save Keldorn. Um, let's see if I can get Jahira down there to maybe maybe heal him. I'll even go down here and try to heal him. Come on, he should be he should be freaking recovering. Okay, I'm gonna try and confuse again. Uh, is there anything I could do with these guys? I don't believe he got stunned. I just don't believe it. Um, yeah, there's nothing I can do. Uh, Swords, not words. Stupid. I've got this stupid, stupid lady back here, too. Okay, finally, he got unparalyzed. Excellent. All right, we got to get out of here, because that stupid guy with that, that, uh, that weapon is kicking our asses. Okay, we definitely want to run back. Run back over here. Okay. And where's Jahira? Jahira is probably... Okay, Jahira is going to get going to get murdered over there. I don't want her to get murdered. Okay, I'm going to summon this guy. And we're going to go ahead and reveal that thief's... Invisibility, come on, Jahira. I told you to do something, you need to do it. This guy needs to die. I'm gonna go ahead and throw up another thing to try and maybe affect people and get them off my butt. Okay, we need to kill this this lady here. Good, got her. Alright, now this guy with the katana, he definitely has to go. He's getting ridiculous. There, okay. That was all right. Now the this guy. Ouch. Oh, that was my... <laughs> okay, now he's gone. Now this guy needs to go. All right, cool. We did it. Not that hard. It's just... Uh, you gotta kill the mage first, apparently. Ready. Mage does not. Is that it? Is that any good? I'll pick it up and find out. There's a used potion bottle, which I don't think has any use in this game. Just, I'm, I'm not sure why they even put it there. Yeah, empty potion bottle. I don't think there's any use for that item whatsoever. So we just ditch it. Is this this is an adventurer's robe? So it's no good. Thought maybe that was the robe of uh, evil or good arch magi or something like that. But nope, it's apparently not. Mace plus two, battle axe plus two, gift of peace. Um, not really that great. Excuse me. 
Uh, full plate metal plus one. Yeah, we have better plate metal plus one. This stuff sells for something, though. Yeah, all this is kind of junk, but there's something that's not junk. It's over here. Uh, the Celestial Fury. This is so awesome, this thing. Uh, hit target must save versus spell or be stunned from one for one round. Um, it goes right through resistance. Um, the only thing stopping it is a save, which, you know, there's a 5% chance that anybody, no matter how low their saves, is going to fail a save. So 5% chance. If you can hit enough times, you know, you figure if you have... Um, well, if you were to somehow get, like, five attacks per round, right? Within four rounds, you would, on average, you would be um, sure to uh, stun them. And then, of course, once you stun them, you can keep re-stunning them. Unless their saves are, like, really, really low, you know, and you're only going to get a 5% chance. Usually, I mean, yeah, you can, you can like, stun lock golems with this, and it's, it's a really, really awesome weapon. Plus, it, uh, let's see, 5% chance for an extra, extra 20... 20 electrical damage on the on the target absolutely devastating it's a really really awesome melee weapon unfortunately well we're probably not going to put it to much use nobody has katana specialty the only people that can use it are um my hero who's going to be you know shooting most of the time and uh uh, Keldorn and Minsk and actually wait a minute Jan can Jan I guess Jan could probably use that maybe right what's it say no I think Jan could use it Jan can use it and so can Herodalus apparently okay well no, no it's it's all right yeah Herodalus could use it I don't think I'm going to because we have so many other stuff that we're going to be using but um yeah it's not bad I stand ready and if I remember correctly, was there anything in here? Let me just go really quickly check. I seem to remember going in here and looting something. Yeah, there's stuff that's... I think that was basically it. There's nothing... Oh yeah, I forgot to loot the thief here. Thief has... Thief has some visibility potions, which yeah, you can use those sometimes. It's coming handy. So mainly, we're just gonna go sell this junk, I think. Yeah, he's going to sell this junk. I expected as much. So that was fun. That was a fun fight. It's fun going through this game, you know, building, like, making a build, a character build, and just going and, you know, fighting through all the battles and see how well you do with your character build. It's really fun. All right. Yeah, the hell with you, bro. I slept anyway. So, last but not least, uh, the Beholder Quest, which, um, let's see here. What do we get for the Beholder Quest? We do get something that I wanted. Actually forgot what was. Oh, I get, I gotta get the, um, uh, I gotta do the Kangax the Lich thing, and, and down here is where I can get one of the parts that I need for that. So, yeah, okay. Um, uh, be it full plate mill, yeah. Okay, fine. We sell that. We sell this, this. Oh, wait, no, this is fenced. Never mind. Well, I mean, he'll he'll accept it, but I don't want to be cheesy. Um, did, no, Celestial Fury, no, but I'll sell this. I'll sell this, I'll sell this, I'll sell this, I'll sell this. Sell this, sell this. Gift of Beast, not, not really worth it. Battle Axe plus two, sell it. And uh, what else here? Jan has a couple of things I'm going to sell. These are not fenced. I'm going to go ahead and sell this. This is Invisible Stalker. I don't think I actually have that spell memorized, so I'm just going to drop that in for my next memorization spree there that we hit whenever we hit that. And I certainly don't need this keep key anymore. We've got $41,000. Let's go. Yeah, what is what do I get for this? Oh yeah, will I get the Canagax thing? And uh, I don't remember what I get for this quest here. But we definitely get experience and we need some experience. I want to at least have level six spells before I go into the Underdark. Actually. Now nah, we'll get there anyway, huh? Because we'll have to do some quests for Bodhi. 
But yeah, this is the last thing I want to kind of clear up here. Oh, wait a minute. Nope, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Just remembered something else. Just remembered something else. We can now come in here. Uh, we got the key to this in Ferkreg's place. I stand ready. So we're gonna go fight some mind flares. So be it. I can't believe I didn't dispel that bull crap. Okay. Yeah. So with mind flares, you definitely want to use chaotic chaotic commands. I have one memorized. Really, all we need is just a chaotic command like uh, Keldorn or something. I do not care much for being all the time. But yeah, they have like a, a spell that insta-stuns you and it's really annoying. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and cast um, go ahead and cast uh, protection from fear too. Just to be safe. Okay, we should mop the floor with these guys. Anyway, we'll be seeing more of these guys. These guys are kind of a pain in the ass in, in several places in the storyline. Let me go ahead and protect you from evil, Keldorn. Oh, maybe not! Maybe not, because somebody hit me. What the heck? What the? Whoa! Oh, he got mind flared. I know there was a freaking mind flare. All right, well, hold on. Let me reload that. I don't remember there being a mind flare here. Maybe I'm misremembering. Let's let these guys come to us this time. Yeah, Minsk got, uh, Minsk with his low intelligence gets mind flared pretty quick. All right. Let me go ahead and let's lure these guys out, shall we? I pledge my service and my life if need be. Um, I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna go snipe these guys. Let me see if I can. Mince, give me your boots, please. Swap boots again. Pretty soon we're gonna have three boots of speed. I. No, 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 no. I didn't say go rushing in like that. Get out of the way. Alright. Kill him. They're really wimps if you don't count the, the mind drain thing. Okay, this guy must die. This guy needs to die. There we go. We've got to level up. Oh, Herdellus, nice. Maybe he'll get his six level spells, huh? Level it up. Yeah! One one more proficiency point. So he got yep, he got his six level six spells finally. Um, what do we actually want to put, uh, let's see, we want to put an axe, we got axe, okay, we got axe, what else do we want, katana, how about a crushing weapon, how about a warhammer, yeah, we're gonna go warhammer, because he's got a warhammer that he can use eventually, or he did, or actually, I should have put in flail, we'll, we'll get another, um, proficiency point at some point, he's only level 16, he gets to level 40. So, but we did get our level six spells, which is freaking awesome. So we got protection from hate, or we got improved haste. And uh, level six is where kind of your mage spells get useful. And we got to give him uh, um, protection from magical weapons. This sparrow is ready to fly. At your so improved haste, that's a big, big deal. Doubles your num number of base attacks. As you can imagine devastating on like an archer or something like that. Oh, let's get the hell out of here. Let's run, 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 run,
hero. Got it. Let's see if I can dispel that. Okay, at the very least, what you can do is you can actually hit yourself with, um... Oh, it didn't work. Well, sometimes you can do that. You can just hit yourself with a uh, car summer that dispels effects or a weapon that dispels effects. And he's really stunned, man. I should be able to... Huh. That's interesting. I should have been able to dispel that. Maybe it's undispellable? What the freaking hell, dude? I told you to do this. There you go. Because they dispel at level 30... Apparently, I guess you can't dispel it. That's my only explanation. Or it must be really high level because it should have been dispelled by now. That sucks. Well, I guess... Uh, no, wait. Maybe I could just heal it off, huh? Lasts a long time. Nope. Even that doesn't do it. That's horrible. Uh, yeah, there's... I'm sure there's spells that can... You're supposed to do something about that, right? Um, let's see, neutralized poison, chaotic commands, no, you would think heal would do it, hmm, yeah, I don't know, how are you supposed to cure that, that is a, that is a tough I son of a to gun, alright, well, finally wore off, all right, so, uh, yeah, let's, um, <laughs> chaotic commands, of course. Usually, I used to deal with this just by, by casting chaotic commands on everybody. Okay, let's go ahead and double Keldorn's attack, shall we? So we got four attacks per round. We're just going to send him in there and have him kick butt. Four attacks per round is pretty devastating, but you gotta worry about the Mind Flare Drain. We already have the Mind Flare Drain happening. You point, I punch. Swords, not Let's see here. Can I, I need to conjure up some, like, something. Golems are another way to deal with these guys. If you have that book that summons golems, he's pretty much immune to anything they can do to him. I guess he does get mind mind drained at some. Oh wow! Oh wow! Okay, I guess that psionic blast even goes through resistance. I don't remember it doing that. No, I don't think it did. Psionic blast did not used to go through resistance. What the heck? What the freaking heck, bro? Yeah, it didn't. I'm I'm almost positive it didn't used to go through resistance. Also, be aware that these guys, these Mind Flayers, they have like five attacks per turn. So even though, I mean, the thing about attacks is they have like a minimum, you know, a 5% chance to actually do critical hits. Which means that, obviously, if they critical hit, they auto, they, they'll hit you no matter how low your armor class. What happened there? Where'd he, how'd he die? Where'd he die? What? Where'd he die? Where'd he die? Did he get mine? Oh, bull crap, dude. I'm calling that bull crap. Okay, another mind flare drain. Die. Die. Bull crap. Bull crap. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the heck is going on? Why is my guy not firing? God dang it. That looks like this is a reload. Good lord. Good lord. Okay. Well, we're going to have to do it the old-fashioned way, I think. We're going to actually have to have Jahira learn a little bit more of that um, Chaotic Commands. Because uh, that one is not cutting it. Just one. Just being able to cast that once is just not cutting it. Okay, Keldorn, myself. You can also just trap them. In fact, that might be a good idea to set, set a few traps here. So, now all of a sudden that stun bypasses magic resistance. This is interesting because I, I'm 
positive that wasn't the case. I've set a trap for the feet of the unwary. Positive that wasn't the case. I've set a trap for the feet of the Okay, unwary. so if they get this far, then they get trapped. Yeah, it's bunk. They shouldn't be able to bypass resistance like that. What happened? Oh, he set the last one, I guess. I my raven. Okay, we're we're definitely we're gonna double haste my hero here, and then we're gonna haste everybody. In fact, I'm just gonna send the hero in there. I think we're gonna turn off the AI, and I'm just gonna have my hero snipe since they can't hurt him now. This guy's a bastard, man. There, die. I I find I do this a lot. It's just have like one hero just buff to buff to max, and then just have him do all the damage. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and turn on my. Die, die, ouch! What's this? oh god? His intelligence is getting hit. We don't want him to die here. Got him. All right, jeez, man. Jeez, man. All right, I forgot what was in here. Let's go ahead and do the this thing where we uh, sleep a little bit. Go ahead and cast Chaotic Commands again. It's really, uh, my goal in this game is to kind of get where I don't have to buff, pre-buff myself and just go through every fight, you know, just just run through it. It's kind of my own personal goal here. We're not quite there yet, though. Oh, holy crap. Whoa, holy crap. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what's... Let's go ahead and dispel that real quick. No, you don't. No, you don't. Okay. Hold on, Jan. What's what's your what's your intellect, Jan? Okay, eleven. Okay, get that guy quick before he kills me. Okay, good. Okay. Good lord. Jahira is just about to die. Jahira is stunned. I can't do anything about it. Oh, crap. I just can't do anything to these guys, man. Okay. Kill him. Kill him before he kills me. Whew. God dang it. Okay. Oh, God. Jan's gone. God dang it. That is not easy. So, we lost... Oh, my God. There's no... What the heck? Another one? Is this guy's just spawning in here? Man, what a pain in the ass. Yeah, it's nice to be able to have... Uh, you know, be able to take a few hits from those guys, as you can see. If you can't take any hits from them, then, you know, you tend to be... Yeah, you tend to have a little trouble. It's kind of a bigger pain in the ass, and it's really worth... What is this? Is Illithid Correspondence? Yeah, okay. Uh, this is the, um... This is the Hammer of Thunderbolts, which is part of Chrome Fair. That's, uh... So we want to get that. Come on, Jahira, wake up. I think Jahira has my Staff of Resurrection, so... I gotta wait for her to wake up to resurrect Jan. Oh my god. Thunderbolts plus three. Wand. Okay. Wand of... This is the wand. This is some weird wand. Okay, it doesn't say it, but this actually does five... Um, five lightning damage every time it hits. It's... Chrome Fear is a really, really nice weapon and really, really useful later. 
So we're definitely going to... Yeah, I think we're going to make it, despite the fact that I could use one of the parts for, you know... I am ready. I could could use just one of the parts just to boost my um, my strength, where I didn't have to wear that all the time. But I think we'll probably will will um, make Chrome Fear. Oh, I'm tired of having to pick my crap up like this, man. I carry the world if I could, but you'll have to package it smaller. I've got a room. And that's my alarm. Okay, so we got what we needed here. Let's get the heck out of here. What? Is there a griffin about? Yes, I have very many fallen comrades. Let us endeavor to all right so now let's go to the beholder section here well oh, first um, that's right we have to first we have to kill another lich you must gather your party before venturing forth. I pledge my service and my life if need be I believe is this trapped? I stand ready. It's definitely locked though, right? Oh, that's right. Never mind. I have to go do this. Okay. So we got to go. Yeah, that's why you got to do the beholder crest. Okay. So I got to go get the key over here and to do that, I've got to go uh kind of pretend like I'm joining this cult. All right. So we're going to go ahead and do that when we continue in the next video.